What's going on guys? Uh today I'm doing a re review on this uh Cover Pro portable shed from Harbor Freight. Uh, I bought this just so I could store my kids' power wheels and stuff of great not of uh not that high of a value and you know make some room in, in my shed that's made out of wood for other stuff. And uh I actually built this with the frame underneath the, like a small deck out of a two by four. And a couple sheets of plywood. Uh, I will sh walk right now and show you what um, the things I like and the things that I don't like about this shit. But as far as assembly goes, you know, it, it's pretty much like snapped together. This is this is probably the only thing up here um, that you need to put together with bolts. And then the following stuff down here, just so you guys know, if you plan on buying this. It's just push pipe, like you push it together and that's about it. Nothing else is holding it down besides the tarp. Uh, other than that, as far as the tools, you'll probably need a socket and a wrench to put this together. Uh, impact socket and a wrench pretty much sums that up. And then um, as far as the anchoring goes, you get these uh, dirt anchors that actually, you know, they go into the ground. And they'll they'll give you a small little wire link with uh, U bolt connectors. I think they're called U bolt or or um, clamp rope clamp uh, connectors that you have to like clamp down and whatnot. If you're mounting it onto the the ground, like the dirt, if you don't want that thing to fly out. But being that I put mine on wood, uh, I'm gonna show you what I'm possibly gonna do later on, just to keep it from. Uh, flying off and whatnot from here the bottom of it is going to have a t-bracket and then i'll have another uh, four-way bracket in the middle that do need connections with bolts which are down here and then the top need to be connected with bolts but the rest of this all just completely goes together so let me walk over there and show you guys um, it's not that hard to assemble you will need at least two people Preferably three people to help you um, erect it and whatnot when you're putting on the tarp. So let's walk over there. There it is. It's pretty much what I did. It was a two by four decking. This is on slate, so it's really not gonna rot out that quick. But no. Like both of those uh, sides there have zippers on them and then here's basically the finished product it's already um, you know put up a tarp uh, this is like the blue tarp so it's not that sturdy I don't recommend you leaving this up in the winter if you get in the area where you get snow because it probably will accumulate and eventually rip but I probably will have to come up with something different to put up on the roof uh, just so it could withstand the snow or I might just take uh, take the whole tarp down this one and probably buy one of those blue tarps and set it up with a sheet of plywood up there I, I don't know yet but this is what it's basically housing my kids toys my lawnmower you know random stuff not that much high of a value uh, the bottoms do not get strapped down as you can see um, same thing on that side um, these are the brat the ratcheting straps that come with the kit they go into uh, the bottom pole right here so what I was gonna do is gonna, I was gonna get one of those conduit uh, pipe clamps and then basically put a strap here to hold that piece down and then as far as the connectors here that I told you that don't have bolts, only the bottom ones down there and the top ones up here, I'm probably going to get some sheet metal screws and, you know, not go through the whole pipe itself, but halfway here, put another one there and then another one here because this all could just come up if you wanted to pull it apart. And same, same thing up here, probably another sheet metal screw, but, um, you know, as far as keeping stuff out of the rain, it does the job. Um, I don't recommend this for like a permanent thing, especially if you want to have tools or you know you get a lot of heavy rain, um, heavy snow. 
so this is it this is my review let me know what you guys think if anybody has any other ideas let me know in the comments below Bye, see you later